Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? No, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Like a bug on a windshield. Splat. All because he made one stupid crack about the guy's suit. Freaking intense. Dude's got issues, man. Big ones. Who's there? Okay, that did it. Should be able to hop that wall. <clears throat> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. You see the way he came through here? The guy's like an animal. Both of them are. But they're on our side. You two, Goss, get over here! Iodine, but no antibiotics. I need to keep looking. All right, all right, all right. Locations and schedules for your supply lines. I don't have that in Believe me. More supplies over there. Need to get past these guys. Stuff. Just give us the info and we'll stop. Don't have clearance for that. Uh, that? That's not what Benson wants to hear. Stupid to me. Glad the boss took this contract. Why are the super dudes so set on taking out these relief centers? Something about odd. They want to show how weak he is, that he can't protect the city. <laughs> Sounds like a lot of drama. As long as they let us keep all the supplies we find, I don't care. Yeah, man. This stuff will be worth a fortune on the black market. Come on, let's keep digging through it. Who's there? Stable guys give up the depot locations? Eventually, yeah. yeah the big guy's taking the station out all by himself. Dudes are walking A-bomb. It's that Russian blood, man. Makes him crazy. That's offensive. My grandma's Another Russian. supply tent. A couple trauma kits, but no antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. Looks like they're gonna divvy up the supplies. Oh boy. They better not try to short us. Hey, you guys better not try to short us. Gotta avoid that sniper. Bro, relax. Everybody gets a take. He's trying to short you. Nice. Dude, please don't embarrass me. Chill. I heard that! Avoid that sniper. Oh boy. Better not 
try to short us. Who's there? Bro, relax. What are you gonna take? Nobody's trying to short you. More supplies. Oh, come on, Crate, be the one. Amoxicillin. Perfect. That is a very large man. I found the exploding bulldozer. Supply routes and schedules. Now! Yes, Kazal! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! Oh, oh, oh. Did not need to see that. Right past them. Yeah. Wait for it.
Oh! Oh! Play more games with me. The way forward is right past them. You test my patience. This oh! Is oh. Not my exit. Let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha! <laughs> Kids right. got guts! Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa! You wanna taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? 
Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to feet. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. find it suspicious that this rhino person always knocks down buildings and tears up roads which someone ends up making money rebuilding? Am I suggesting a conspiracy? You're damn right! Now, if you've seen the man testify in court, you know the rhino is too stupid to plan anything himself. So who's the mastermind? Well, who else is always there? Supposedly fighting Rhino, but actually leading him around like a red cape does a bull. Say it with me, Spider Man. Someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. 
Rhino, let's put the team up. I thought you were a loner. So what's the end for these particular means? Freedom! True freedom! No more you! No more rhino! this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't do Beg him to give up? Yes, God, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. Finds out you failed! I failed? Yes, you freak show! A little sports together time might help you boys learn to play nice.
All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. My friends, the Rhino and the Scorpion are back behind bars. But only after wreaking unimaginable havoc in a reckless rampage with Spider-Man. Hopefully, they'll never see daylight again. But we need to be ready if they do. Normal humans can't stand against the likes of the Rhino. So, here's my proposal. You've heard of police dogs, right? Now bear with me. We train, outfit, and deploy police rhinoceroses. You got a rhino? We got a rhino too, baby! Can't leave this place operating. I'll try to close it down stealthily so no one gets hurt. Sable set up a million rooftop posts just to hunt for little old me. Sorry. You guys are giving violent mercenaries a bad name! I bet they get medical benefits.
Spider-Man. Thank God. Demons have rigged explosives all over the building, but we can't get close. Point me at him, officer. I'm here to help. We've located the primary device. If you can disable it, it'll cough up an army key. You can use that to locate and disable the secondary device. Got it. Keep your men back. I'll radio when it's clear. Wired in series. Great, disarmed. Dead man switch. The other bombs are armed. Need to disable them before they explode. Heads up. Sniper's on the far roof. those snipers. They could go after the police. the light. You and your men take care, officer. Spider-Man related breakout at Rikers Island. Where are those escapees going now? To your neighborhood! Our next caller witnessed it personally. Please, tell us. I was just coming back from the store when a swarm of guys in prison jumpsuits came out of nowhere. Like a pack of wolves. Robbing, beating, looting. Lucky for us, Spider-Man took them down. Yes, well, you know how criminals are. Rival factions and all. He didn't want the competition. Competition? Spider-Man didn't steal anything. That you know of. Let's call it. Incoming. And we're done.
feel like a daycare instructor the way I have to keep... Units with rise here needed to respond to a violent disturbance. Incident is active near Carnegie Hall. Escape prisoners. Let's see what I can do about the escape part. Time for fire safety lessons with Uncle Fight. Hold it down! The hell is that? I'll kill you! Motorcycles. Cheesy road movie on my life. <laughs> Why not both? <laughs> Gonna make you pay for that! seen the city this bad since, well, since never. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay, Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me, the lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Have people been waiting down here long? No, no. Only one or two hours. We all greatly appreciate Sable International's generous assistance with security. Has the penthouse been affected? Oh my, no. The new security room in the back of the lobby ensures that the mayor remains totally undisturbed. Because Sable took over building security. Routine sweep, they're calling it. Checking for weapons or explosives or something. All this just to make Osborne feel safer. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room. That guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. 
Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back upstairs. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Get out here right now. We're Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please well, remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. Hello. Swear I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet okay. you. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. What was that? Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Watch your sixes, men. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. 
Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Doors are locked till the system check finishes. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. The fabulous Osborne boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Self-diagnostic complete. No faults found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but... Was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Looks like Norman locked up Harry's room. I wonder why. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, Anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow, haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Norman and Otto, wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this?
Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. for Harry, can it? Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. They plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. 
I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Better check it out. Compromised. creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. <laughs> 